find the equation of the line that is perpendicular to x plus 2y plus 5 equals 0 and passes through the point 3 and 2. That, of course, is question number 3. Okay, to get started, let's just rewrite this equation in y equals mx plus b format. And how can we do that? Well, we can subtract x and 5 from both sides of the equation because we want to isolate y completely. So 2y is equal to negative x minus 5. Then I can divide both sides by 2. So y is equal to negative x over 2. There's a hidden 1 here. So I can rewrite this as negative half x minus 5 over 2. Fantastic. OK, so we know the slope of this line is negative half, because it's already in y equals mx plus b format. So whatever's multiplying the x is the slope. So that is the slope of this line. But we're interested in the perpendicular slope, because that is the perpendicular slope is going to be the slope of our new line, because the lines are perpendicular. And what is the slope of the line that is perpendicular to negative half? Well, what is the negative reciprocal of negative half? It will be negative the reciprocal of half. And the reciprocal of half is 2 over 1. But we already had the negative here, so I almost forgot that. There we go. Negative, negative, make a positive. So we get positive 2 as the perpendicular slope to negative half. So we always just switch the signal, right? And of course, the reciprocal of half is just 2. Fantastic. So now this is going to be the equation of our new line. We can plug 2 in for m and we know that the line goes through or passes through the point 3 comma 2. So that's the x value and the y value. Now we can plug these coordinates in to solve for b. Once we isolate b, we know that what the y-intercept is for the new line. So y is 2, x is 3, 2 is equal to 2 times 3, which is 6, plus b. I can subtract 6 from both sides of the equation. 2 minus 6 is negative 4. So that is the y-intercept. So the equation of our line is y equals 2x, the 2 came from the slope of course, plus b, which is negative 4. So here we have y equals 2x minus 4. Sorry, I just blanked out for a second. Here we go. And that is the equation of the line that is perpendicular to x plus 2y plus 5 equals 0 and passes through the point 3 and 2. That's it. 